Greetings, fellow Tarnished. It is the Ash Heritor, and welcome back to Elden Ring. In the last episode, we uncovered some secrets about some things that transpired in Landell. Now, not much is clear, but the involvement of the Black Knife Assassins goes very deep. And here we are at the Ringleader's Everjail. You'll see my runes here. That's because I've made several attempts, and I decided, ah, screw it, you don't need to see all of those. That was just me dying horribly. Uh, so here we are. Uh, I killed the three dragons up there. By the way, they don't respawn, and they drop dragon hearts. But I didn't find them to be... It was not a very interesting fight. Uh, I fought them one at a time, and they were a bit buggy with falling off of cliffs, and then me having to chase them down to the bottom of the cliff, only for them to despawn right when I get to them. It was pretty annoying, so I decided I'm not going to include it in part of the episode. Anyways, you get three dragon hearts out of it, so it's a good place to farm to get those dragon communion invocations. So here we are, we're going in, um against Electo, the Black Knife Ringleader. So, she's very difficult. <laughs> I'll say that now. <laughs> she has a move that will basically one-shot you if you're too close. Now, I think I've gotten the hang of it, of not being too close. Okay. Okay, that didn't do much. Hey, good, good, good. I need to just maintain distance. When not... And then I just need to be aware, because she, she shoots at you too. She does the same move that I do. It's just being in close with her is a fucking nightmare. Yeah, so this is the instant kill move. It's basically an instant kill. It's not quite, but it's, it's damn close. Okay. Not worth it. Um, do we have any other incantations? We absolutely do. Yeah. Okay, wow, she actually fucking dodged all of them. That is... That's something. <laughs> okay, pull away. Don't want to get hit by that. And we can try this, because she's going to try it on us. <laughs> Alright, that was a trade, and it was not a good one. That decreased our max health. For her, it's not that big of a deal. <laughs> For me, it's a fucking big deal. It's just such a relentless move set. Holy crap. Not worth it since I'm in, like, one-shot mode here. Okay, we're good. And that's the instant kill. We don't want to get hit by that. Let's, let's give this one. Nice. And let's try this again. Nice. Nope, okay. Fill up. Juice up, I should say. All right, that's fine. You want to do that? You can do that. Yes, good. Don't want to be near you with your, uh... Black Wolf of Farron funky move set. Nope. Oh boy. That was close. <laughs> ah! Jerk. Nice. Actually landed a hit on her. <laughs> a regular old hit. Damn it. <laughs> She's so dodgy. It's a cool fight though, I will say. I, I like this fight. It's just very hard. <laughs> I don't feel it's unfair or anything. The one-hit kill move is easily dodgeable if you know how to do it. Oh, bad. Very bad. Okay, it's fine. Nope, it's not. God damn it. Well, we got close. Uh, I've been... First couple of times I attempted this, I got her to, like, three-quarters health. Um, but then once I figured out how to avoid her uh, explosion instant kill move... Which is basically just, you move away from it <laughs> when she starts charging it up, and you're fine. But I didn't realize that the first three attempts, so it, it, it killed me dead. Um, this deer has died many a time, <laughs> let me tell you. <laughs> is it worth grabbing my runes every time? Well, I mean, it's 22,000. It's, it, it's something. It's not much, but it's something. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll do this again. Um, actually, I may as well two-hand this, right? But that actually does more damage when I'm two-handing it. Don't ask me the logistics of two-handing a knife, but it is what it is. Give, her to, give it to her again. Nice. Do it one more time. Nice! She took four of those. That's unusual. Normally she does not. Okay, that was not the best trade in the world. Nice. Very good. 
All right. Nice try. Using my own moves against me. So where you get killed by the big blast is when you're like chugging and you get caught out in it. That's when it's bad. All right. I was expecting her to stagger because she does stagger very briefly. It's not like a major, ah, fuck. Get her. Nope. The dodge. Oh my God. Nope. Rolling away is not a good plan. Neither is ducking now. That was actually fine. <laughs> ah, dodgy. Oh my God. He's got a lot of reach. All right, damn it. I thought I would uh, be able to uh, jump over that, but apparently it didn't work. That was lucky. Ah! Uh-oh. Hey, nope. Do not dodge into her. Not, not a good plan. Oh, she's so fucking nimble. Okay, that was not ideal. Uh-oh, this isn't ideal either. Yep, got caught out. That was unfortunate. Yes, we get it. I'm dead. Yep. Give it another go. What was that all about? I didn't even press the attack button. Now it scared away the deer, which I can't murder. That makes me upset. There we go. Now I can rest it rest easily. Or die. Die in peace. Yes, that's what I'm doing. It's a matter of principle, okay? Let's actually try the tibia summons here. I don't know. It's not usually good, but... No, why am I doing it this way? That is way too fucking slow. Yeah, that sucks. That, that's legit just terrible. What is with these fucking spells? Why, why are they so bad? Honestly. So it seems like the max health doesn't actually um, decrease past that point. Which is good, I guess. Did we just dodge? No, we did not. We got totally tagged by that. All right, I'll count myself lucky for only getting hit by one of those attacks. All right, that was good. One more. Yes, good. She dodged a bit early. All right, now we need to... Uh-oh. Yeah, that's that. We don't want to get hit by that, ever. That's unfortunate. Not good. Not good at all. Heal now. Ah! Healing is slow. Yeah, see, she staggers sometimes. Even on, like, a first hit. Oh, man. Woo! If I wasn't basically panic rolling, I would have been dead. Okay, I think I'm dead. Yep. Not much I could have done there. I was, when she began that move, I was straight up too close. Ugh. Yeah, these, these death sorceries... These death sorceries are really disappointing, I will say. Now, I didn't know when I specced into them, I figured they'd be... Decent, because, like, all of the sorceries in the game thus far, uh, I'm playing a knight sorcerer character, and, like, the sorceries in general are pretty good. Um, so, little did I know that... Why do I have less health? Excuse me? Where did I lose health from? Switching items? Actually, there's my setup here. Faith boosts. No, we don't need this because we're not using our uh, incantations here. Uh, we've got shortened spell casting time is good. Uh, yeah, I mean we could do the raises potency of sorceries to see if that really affects things. Um.
Yeah. No, 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 no. Okay. Just looking for something. Look for a better uh, talisman here, basically. What's going on here? I mean, boost physical damage negation isn't bad. What is the damage type here, actually? Right? So, yeah, it does holy damage. And I imagine, does the, uh... Actual Ash of War also do holy damage. Rune of Death to fire off a blade-like projectile. I, I I don't know what kind of damage that does. Um, well, and I I asked this because if they're doing holy damage, that means I'm taking holy damage. Right? Greatly boost non-physical damage reduction. Or damage negation, I should say. Maybe I should just equip this one instead of the physical damage negation. But I am taking physical damage. Like, that is a thing. Although, honestly... Run it like this. Because I, I find myself running out of stamina in this fight. Wow, we're uh, very close to dead. Let's not be dead. Okay. Uh-oh. Oh, God! I rolled backwards. I wasn't... Yeah. I didn't really detect which one she was doing. I thought she was doing the, uh, the explosion. No escape. All right, into the ever jail we go. Like, we're, we're already out of stamina. Okay, that was good. Alright, that's fine. Nice. I did that twice even. We haven't used a single flask yet. Though... So. I think I've only had one fight where I've actually run out of flasks and died because of that. Most of the time she kills me because of, uh, things like... Okay, I'm glad I healed there. Well, no, if I wasn't healing I would have been able to dodge it, but... Okay, this is fine. And this... Christ, I'm out of... <laughs> out of focus. Heal. Or juice, juice, juice. Pull away. Okay. Nice. Little, little poke. What is that move? Is that like a grab or something? I don't even want to know. She has a grab. It's probably awful. <laughs> Uh-oh. Yes, we interrupted it. Holy crap, that was clutch. Oh, wow. That was a backwards roll that actually worked. Nice. Nice. Only problem is we're almost dead. Woo! I will consider myself lucky. Uh-oh. We traded. Oh, she went down. No way. I didn't know you could do that. I mean, 
Of course you can. Nope. Pull, pull back. Pull back. Dodge sideways. Oh, man. Thought I would be out of range. I was not. Nope, we're dead. Oh, fuck's sake. That is so terrible. Hey, we actually survived that for once. Cost me uh, two flasks to get through that, but hey, we lived. God damn! If you would just let me get some fucking distance for a split second, you get out of here. Oh, God. He is so relentless. <laughs> and, like, she doesn't stagger much. Like, at most, you stagger her for a split second, but then she's just got this ultra-fast dodge that just puts her out of your range completely. So... There's not much point in me trying to bing bring the bigger weapon. Like, yes, it staggers more, but I don't think it does it quite enough. Like, yeah, sure, maybe if I was using, like, a colossal weapon, that would do the job, but I refuse to use those, so... This is the situation we're in. Alright. Let's go. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna try it. Alright. That was actually a shit ton of damage. Do it again. Okay. And she takes damage as she comes through here. You know what? I... Uh-oh. God damn it! You're committed, though. And she pulls that, you're just dead. But I will say that uh, wasn't bad. In fact, this might actually, you know, you know, I just wanted to try it again. Because I tried it once and it was not very effective. But this time it actually worked pretty well. I, you just have to be more careful with the uh, the death blast or whatever the hell it is. So uh, let's just, you know, as soon as she shows up, we land this here. And then we give him the... Okay. Yeah, see, that is one of the issues I encountered. Okay. Alright. Not bad. Nope. Uh-oh. This is bad. Ah, oh, God. See, when she does that attack, that is a good point to punish. Her jumping attack. Nope. But, hey, you know, that dealt some damage to her. Hey. And it does stagger, I will say. Oh, yeah. Okay, confirmed. She has a she has a uh, a grab, and I don't know how much damage that does. I was not at full health, so I don't know if it's an instant kill, but it certainly does a lot of damage. <laughs> That's my first time being hit by it, or at least I, I may have been hit by it uh, when I attempted this the first time. Like many many episodes ago, when I first came up here and was totally not ready for this encounter. <laughs> Now I feel like I can do it. It's just hard. Like I said, this is not a fight I'm complaining about mechanically. It's it's fine. Yeah, that's... Okay. Okay, I need to not open with this. That's, that's my issue. This thing's fine once the fight started, but as an opener, not worth it. Okay, this is just going terrible. Jesus Christ. Brutal. That worked. That worked quite well. That also worked okay. Hey, that even knocked her over. Hey, give her a good old whack. Yes, let's de-lock her. That sounds great. Alright, give her give her this again. Hey, yeah, what now? Ah, darn. But that, that's a stagger, for sure. Okay, we'll do that. She'll have to run into the fire. She wants to come to me. Hey, that did not stagger her. Okay, so when she's doing that, she doesn't stagger. That, that's at least what it looks like. That's, that's fine. It's, uh... Okay. 
brutal. Wait, uh, she got away. Okay, I thought I thought it suddenly didn't do any damage, but she was not present. Okay, back to our flasks. Dodge that. All right. Yes. Excellent. Okay, not not great. Okay, we're we're in close. Oh, that was the that was the grab. Okay, Go away. Yes, now. Damn, got away. He's still taking damage from it every time I do that, though, so that's that's some fuck. Misjudged distance. We may be able to do it this time, actually. That'd be great. Oh, not when he does that. Okay, problem. Okay, pull back, pull back. Heal, heal. Okay, clutch heal. Come here. Come here. Yeah, just like this. Oh, okay. Oh, boy. That was close. Almost dead. Heal. Nope, 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 nope. Please stop. Okay. And this one, please. Okay, we're down to our last heal. Yes! That was good. That was very good. You didn't even take damage there for some reason. Don't ask. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yes, good. Nope. I'm gonna get caught out by that. Oh my god, so many attacks. It's so fast. <laughs> die, please. Please die. No, she's still alive. <laughs> no. no, that's that. Don't, don't. Okay. Alright, sudden death. Please die. No, why are you over there now? Oh no. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, what? We could fucking summon one? Uh, worth it. <laughs> well, we have our thematic summon. Like, of course there's the skeletons, but... The wielders of destined death? Hell yeah. It's a fun fight, let me tell you. That is actually a really fun fight. It's very hard, but goddamn. <laughs> It's exciting. Holy shit. And we get, uh, Black Knife Taiki, was it? Again, going with the Greek names here. Kinda cool. Well, finally, let's get some information. Taiki was one of the assassins who, on the night of the plot, imbued her Black Knife with the Rune of Death and slew Godwin the Golden. She was the daughter of the Black Knife ringleader, Alecto, and was killed protecting her mother during their flight from the royal capital. Okay. Right, so they broke into the royal capital. They murdered Godwin at Rani's behest. Right? And as they were escaping, they killed all the, the finger crones. That, that must have been it. Or maybe they killed them while they were going in. Um, but it seemed like they just got bushwhacked when leaving. Like, we find the injured one all the way back in Limgrave. You find other ones elsewhere. They're, like, hiding, right? They're hiding in catacombs, for the most part. There's the one with the Black Knife Prince that's trying to conceal what they've done. Uh, that's right up... Somewhere. There. In the Black Knife Catacombs. So you find them all over the place. And, yeah. It's interesting. So they fled. But what are they doing here? Why why was Taiki here? Sorry, uh, Electo here. Who imprisoned her? Because this implies that the Everjails were created after the plot. Who created the Everjails? Where are we going with this? Jump? Just... Is there, is there a reason for this jump? Aside from that it's fun? Like, uh, we just literally... Hold on. Well, we go this way. Huh? Ooh. No? Okay. Um, yeah. That was cool. Great fight. Uh, let's go back to round table hold. And, uh, level... I key up. I'm I'm using her. I am absolutely using her. I, I have no idea if she's good. But it's just too cool. Too cool not to use. Greetings. Are you here for spirit tuning? Yes, actually. Black knife Taiki. Uh that's a legendary. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's a legendary one. So we need the the ghost glove warts. Let's get him going. How far can we go? 
Solid. Plus 9. It's not quite to plus 10. I know, by the way, the Mimic tier is like the super meta thing, uh, but I'm not going to use him. Yeah, we already know what that is. Um, let's actually see, dude. Can I upgrade any weapons? Yes, I know. You always take me for dead. Uh, no. I do not have the correct... I need, uh, Smithing Stone 7s. I need more of that for the Godskin Peeler. I need 8s for the Prince of Death Staff. And, uh, these I need, uh, Somber Ancient Dragon Smithing Stone. I guess that's probably the final version. And then we need Somber Smithing Stone 8. And presumably 9 for, uh, the Death Poker. Well, that the Death Poker is already that good, even though it's, like, way less statted up. Um, let's quickly go around and talk to people. Actually, I'm gonna look in Fia's, in the room where Fia killed, uh, D, just to see if there's anything new there. I doubt it, but on the off chance there is, could be interesting. Oh my god. Can't break the tables. Chairs, though, they gotta go. Alright. Hmm, <laughs> So, I will go, um, speak to, uh, Sir Gideon Offnir. The All-Knowing! What is it? Do you know anything? There are four more. Nicola, of his twin, Luna Prince, and Rani is set. So, here at the home, if you should learn it, I'll trade you. We I don't think, uh, yeah, we don't have any information to trade him yet. I don't know what you need to get information, or what you, what you need, uh... Do we have any bell- oh yeah, we have EG's bell bearing here now, so we can purchase, uh... Actually, we can purchase these. I don't need anything from here. No, we don't have good enough ones. Yeah, what did we get from EG Shop? Okay, just somber smithing stones, but like the lower tier ones. Not particularly great. All right, let's uh, let's let's be gone from here. Um, or two, back to back to Lane Dell, I guess, right? So yeah, thank you, Tarbaz. Uh, that. That the, uh, the corridor there with, uh, Melina is not fully endgame. That being said, I don't think I want to go there just yet. Um, because there were some other places that I wanted to check out first. So there was the, um, oh man, I can't tell which one was which. And where all of these things were. Hold on. Okay, I, I hope you guys can't hear that. <laughs> it's, uh, a little bit noisy outside. And if I close the windows, I'll boil to death. It is infernally hot. Here in the Netherlands. Okay, so we're back here. Um, we had... Did we go down here? No, we did not go down that way yet. But we did go down this way, right? This will lead us to cheeky bastard. Oh, you little shit! Ow! He does a lot of damage. Um, hmm. How do we get down here? Uh, no. Who's who's even doing that? Somebody's shooting bubbles at me from like the void. Oh. Actually, I think I know how to get down there. And I think the way to get down there is by going through here, because we just opened the gate. So there's the Godric soldiers, and there's actually a whole... Yeah, we're gonna go to the balcony and then drop down to the street. I think we can drop down to the street from the balcony. And then we'll just walk through the front gate. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Perfect. Perfect. Alright, we didn't even go that way yet. Did I check back here? Yeah, I did. I checked these two areas. Excuse me? What's that? Somebody just shot something at me. Ah, it's one of you. Oh, shit. No, we're, uh, we're not where we need to be. This is, uh... This is the wrong place. But, if I recall correctly, there is actually a way to where I need to be. Clutch! Right, I have the, like... Oh, you guys do get up. Alright, I really need to get on to killing them. All right, here we go. Brutal. That is... Wow. 
Well, uh... I guess... Revenge is mine. From beyond the grave. But it's okay, we're all gonna get back up again anyway, so... It's fine. Totally fine. Alright, none of that. Okay, where are the, uh, the little shits? There's one. Oh, he lived. Unbelievable. And you... Lived again. Okay, he's trying to shoot at me. Alright. Where did you even come from? Little bastard. Alright, that's enough of that. Okay, mate. Here. Have some of this! God, it's effective. And it looks cool. It's just, it's so satisfying. I fucking love this weapon. I have a feeling that we're gonna get shot. Destroy! Beautiful. So destructive. Oh! There it is. How the fuck did I miss this? Did I not go down here or something? I'm... Hmm. What's, uh, what's the best course of action? Why don't we actually... Uh... Alright, and then we can uh, drop down on this. And kill it that way. Ah, Christ on a fucking bicycle. Where, where did you even come from? Oh, God. Why are they here? I hate them. I hate them so much. I mean this in the meanest way possible. You guys remind me of the fucking worms in the, uh... Lecture hall building. No, in the, in the, uh, research building in, uh... The Bloodborne DLC. Ones that have, like, their arms straight-jacketed to their sides. Absolutely revolting. I mean, it's actually kind of similar because the Alban Orcs are being experimented on as well. Um, hmm. Hmm. Okay, going down wells. When has when have uh, when is going down wells ever been bad in a Souls game? Certainly not in Bloodborne. The one, the well in Bloodborne is one of the nicest places in the whole game. What do we got here? Have I been here? I feel like I'm gonna get fucking shanked from like every direction. Plus, better remember, there's hands. Alright, what are you doing? You're gonna like ambush me if I came from the other direction, right? What do we got here? Pickled turtlenecks. Why? Alright, that's this loot. Okay. Well, at least we got that. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. A little bit of plague. Ugh. Scarlet rot. It's uh. You know. Um, I was not expecting that to work, but it did. So, what, down the well, I guess? God, look at it. Just, just sitting there like that. Disgusting. Absolutely loathsome. Here. Have some death. Yeah, what now? You're dead. Okay, hey, where's the well again? Is it up here? Oh, where the fuck am I going now? I've been there, right? I am... Yeah, I've been up there. And I've, I've used those ladders, but where, the, where was the goddamn well? Is it here? Excuse me? It's here. Right, so I'm assuming... This is going to be a, uh... Special entrance to the sewers. Which we know we need to find some interesting things down there. So, uh... Yeah, I know, uh... Nuspa Brat, you're, uh... You're the voice in the back of my head telling me to, uh... You know... Embrace the frenzy. But Tarbaz, you, uh... You support my decision of, uh... Becoming a cultist of the Prince of Death. I don't know yet. I don't know where I'm gonna go. I I'm leaning towards cultist of Prince of Death right now, because that... Thus far, that storyline has been really good, but I feel like we haven't ended the the uh, Frenzy Hayata storyline just yet. 
So maybe that'll also be really good. Kind of depends, you know? What do we got up there? The music's changed, first off. Which is uh, interesting. And we have um, alcoves with probably hands in them. Have we been here? I feel like we've actually been here. Well, maybe not. Oh, actually, I don't know. This this no longer looks familiar. In fact, there's... What are... The rats. Okay. Well, rats are not terribly concerning. Oh, yeah. Of course. We can't have useful magic against certain enemies, right? Oh, boy. Really? Three hits from this thing to kill a rat. I, um... Question that. This is very dark and very dingy. Okay, why? I did something. Poison bone darts, and uh, we got ourselves a door that we can open. Interesting. Door to where? Just a shortcut door, or is this actually going to lead to something? Yeah, this is something. Subterranean shunning ground, you say. A shunning ground. To shun is to, like... Yeah, alright. I see why it's a shunning ground. We got omens down here. We know the omens are shunned by most beings on the surface. I am very bad at fighting these guys. Fairly, so we're not going to do that. Alright. We'll do it now, though. Let's go. I feel like this was a mistake. What are you doing? It was spewing death. That's the, the color. The black and yellow is the same color as the fire that's spewed out by the revenants. We know the revenants are cursed. That's like curse fire, I think. That's interesting. Because I've never seen any of the other ones do that. But then again, these also look different. Okay, this is good. Solid. We've got ourselves a sight of grace here. Oak the walls, just to be sure. These all look suspicious. Okay. Hello. How are you doing? Um, do you like Black Flame? Okay, yeah, look. These guys look- these guys look quite a bit different. Damn. Pull away. God damn. We can be very quickly killed by these, I think. Yeah. Damn. It's really cool. Down he goes, and let's give him the uh, power attack there. Nice. Bit sloppy, but, uh, you know, what can you do? Is this open? Cannot be open from this side. Alright. The traditional FromSoft door experience. You dodgy little shit. There we go. Just a double hand. Get him. Yes! Solid. No hugs. No hugs. Oh my god, that is a delayed hug. <laughs> oh my god, the damage. That's uh, gnarly. Okay, okay. Oh. We missed each other there. But not the second time. Alright, these guys are brutal. Alright, so we can go down... I'm gonna look what's over there first before I go down any farther. There's loot here. Golden Rune 11s. Those are pretty good. Oh. Blood soaked. Interesting. Interesting. Blood soaked manchettes. Manchettes formed by tightly wound bandages soaked through with blood. Any protection is welcome for the festering arms beneath. And the face? Even the most ghastly cover is more inviting than the festering face beneath. Jesus, what the hell happened down here? We know, uh, Dung Eater is at work down here. 
But we need to free his corporeal body. What is that? Excuse me? What are we looking at? I mean, it's two omens, but what's the statue? <laughs> A little hard to aim this. We need to stand right in front of it. Yeah, great. Excellent. Really helps. <laughs> okay. Uh, Finger Maiden statue, maybe? I don't know. Got to drop down here, but I think I'd rather take the ladder. I can come back from that. Oop. Where's the bloody ladder? It's over here. All right, let's let's go. Let's go down. It's not a very long ladder. What do we got down here? More omens? Something stomping around somewhere. Ooh. Uh, what are you? Oh, imps. Gargoyles or whatever. Thought that was something. I should expect there to be something, though. Because there isn't anything now. Actually, uh, if we're fighting uh, gargoyles, we need this. This is uh, effective against them. Okay, what's what's coming? Something's coming. Fuck you! Bye! Jerk. God, I hate them. Oh, dear lord. Yep, get out of here. All right, pull away now. Oh, this is a terrible plate. Damn it! Wrong flask. And he's gone. All right. <laughs> There's a scarab somewhere around here too, which I don't like in the fucking slightest, because that's probably going to be in a very precarious situation. Going to compel me to jump down somewhere, which is going to result in my death. Hey, okay, where are you? Oh my god. These ones have... Do they have different heads? Look different for a second. I'll see you there. Don't think that I don't. What? Excuse me? Okay. Alright. I call a bit of bullshit. That works. Any more? Any gonna drop down on me anywhere? Probably. Oh no, they're just gonna hide behind barrels, too. I will say, this isn't the worst weapon against them. Okay, we got we got another shithead coming up. Um, I think we can hit him from here, right? Yeah. That was, that was alright. Get him again. There we go. Fortunately, these are taking two. Oh my god, there's another one. Okay, that's fine. Nope. Nope. Okay, this weapon's actually really good against them. Because you can uh, actually hit them before they hit you. And uh, that is clutch. Yeah, so it worked that time. Oh, really? Oh my god, what? How many of them are there? <laughs> the correct answer to that question is more. Whoopsies. I hate them. Alright, before we do anything else wild, let's uh let's go this way. Smithing stone seven, that's good, I need those. The godskin peeler. Is this going to loop back? Yes, it loops back to this item. Excellent. Oh, God. Oh, God! What's wrong with him? He looks even more distorted than the others. Are you... Yeah, you're hostile. Yeah. Yeah, look, he's got, like, even more cursed stuff. Oh, you may kill me, actually. Son of a bitch. There was a shortcut there. Elmans are pretty rough as as adversaries, we'll say. Alright.
about 15 minutes left for the episode. It's all fine. Now, can I just avoid these? I think I can just avoid these by dropping down. We don't need to use the ladder. All right. Um... Where are you? Right here. I hate them. With burning passion. Later. Nope, you're not killing me. Is there any more? Yeah, of course. Why wouldn't there be? All we need to do is knock them down. Once they're down, I can deal with them. This weapon's pretty good against them, too, because it staggers them, so... You, are, I think, are just going to fall down if we hit you? Yes. Oh, but you don't fall far enough. Crap. And there's one over there. Oh, you're just going to throw shit at me, huh? Alright, fine. I have a present for you. It's called Destined Death. Whoops, wrong button. But, you know what, that's fine. Because that means that'll do the trick. And you, for some reason, were immune to the Destined Death, so I'm going to give you the regular death. Bye! We'll let the big G handle you. Now, where the fuck were the other, like, 16 of them? God, I hate them so much. I hate imps. All right, there was one here. Nice. All right, and then there were like nine more on this platform. Possibly more. Okay, there he is. Yeah, you know, you can be forgiven for... Right when I'm looking up at that one, this little shit drops down on me. All right, now the other one's gonna drop down, of course. No, he didn't. Wow, good, good job. Die. Oh my god, now he comes for me, right when I shoot shit at him. No, none of that. Oh, now you drop down. That's fine. Okay, any more? Okay. I think there's about one other uh, 11 of them somewhere. Yeah, there's one. Is he coming? Yeah, he's coming. Oh, he's gonna start throwing shit at me, huh? Alright, you little jerk. But if I attack you from this side, another one's going to come up behind me, right? That's how that works. Now let's just kill him fast and then jump up here. Or not. Is there another one? No. That's it. Okay. All good. Now what? Um, we got to kill him. Okay, let's, uh, let's start it off with this. That is effective. Ugh, that's painful, though. Heal? I don't want to get caught out. God damn. There's always a second one. Hey! I have a feeling we're gonna die. Hey! I pressed heal twice and it did nothing. That was weird. Last I checked, you don't need stamina to fucking chug. Hey, will you stop that? You're tougher than the others, I feel. Oh, man. I grab my fucking runes. Nope. Not like that, but can't. Ooh, boy. You know, you're almost as hard as Electo. What just hit me? Something else just hit me from behind. Of course. Of fucking course. That was look. That was clutch. We jumped over it, which is pretty cool. One more. I don't know how to do it. So we probably didn't need to, but I'm not taking chances. Shadow bait. What? Excuse me. The shadow bait. We also got the lightning thing. Yeah, we got two new incantations. No, death lightning. We already had. Did we? Yeah, we got this from uh from uh the lich dragon Fortisax. So, it must have been an Ash of War. Yeah. Oh, no way. Thunderbolt. Ash of War. 
that's cool. And then there was this, Shadow Bait. Incantation of the Two Finger Servants, who once served as Assassins of the Round Table, creates a pale gold shadow before the caster, luring foes of human build and attracting their aggression. This incantation can be cast while in motion or crouching, and will still affect foes that are already in a combat state. That's fucking cool. It is said that those beguiled by the shadow see within it a hated foe. I actually think I'm going to use that instead of some of these, like, dumb death sorceries. That, like, the, the, the Rancor Call is okay, the basic one. It's fine, actually. God, I, I'll open it, just because it's a shortcut. Now what? We go back. What's up there? Is that... Yeah, that's how we got down here, of course. All right, I'm going back to the to the room with the pipes. Because there's plenty more to do here, I think. And plus the, the fucking imps are dead. Or at least a number of them are dead. I'm assuming... No! No, you wouldn't. They would. They did. They would and they did. All right, where, where are you? I know you're going to jump out at me as soon as I grab this. No? Okay. That's uh, awful nice of you. Where's the fucking scarab? Okay, I thought there was something on the ceiling, and I almost had a fucking heart attack. Um, all right, there's this shit. Really? Okay, bye. Wow, we even tagged him. That's pretty funny. Alright, uh, that's a problem. Because we are on a, uh, a strict uh, no violence against lobsters playthrough here. So, really? So, you're telling me I was right. And when I said, oh, there's uh, probably still like 15 imps in here, that I wasn't even joking. I thought I would use hyperbole to make myself feel better. Look at him up there. Smug little shit. I don't know. I don't even know how to get up there, though. All I know is how to get down. God damn it. How do we get up there? Not from this direction. All I got is down, and that just doesn't look like a, uh, a drop that you can survive. However, what about... What about here? Huh? No. Don't think so. Okay, I must need to go back up. Where is it? It's it's jingling and dingling, you know? Somewhere in the the, the edge of my uh, sense of hearing. I don't know where it is. Yeah, technically we need to go... So it must be this way. Fuck. This means I have to go through these jerks again. I don't wanna. I mean... <sighs> nah, let's... Let's look at the statue. There's a dead guy praying here. What is it? What are you? Somebody holding their hands. Yeah, interesting. And is there anything behind it? Another question. I don't think I can get up there, though. Well, Darren. Okay. You're coming this way? I guess I have to kill you. So, let's get on that. Ah! Okay, fire poker time. A little bit more effective against these guys. Ugh. Ah! Close to dead. Don't back up too far. Especially not out of this fucking room. Yes! Good, good. Alright, that was delightful. I love this ability so much. It's so good. Can we actually, like, sneak use this? No. But we can do it up close. Brutal. Brutal. Fucking brutal. So brutal. Ow. Ow. Stop it. Here, have another one. Ow. Okay. He doesn't want to. Okay, 
None of that, please. Ah, for fuck's sake. All right, well, at least we have the uh, shortcut here. Question is, I, I just don't know where to go to get to the higher level. Unless I have to somehow stay up on the level uh, where the ladder is. Maybe I just... You know what? I think I'm just going to grab my runes and run up the ladder and hope that they can't go up ladders. I feel like they can, though. I feel like I've done this before in another catacomb. And was, uh... Vexed. Discover. That they can indeed... Go up ladders. Alright. You missed! How does it feel? It'd be bad. Right, wrong side of the fucking ladder. Ow! Come on. Go up. Now. Do not. Alright. Good. No, oh, this this was no, there's nothing else here. Well balls. Um So, oh, my course of action is uh not great. Not that way. We don't need to fight a third one. In fact, let me tell you. I'm going to grab my runes. I'm going to say fuck both of you guys. And I'm going to run down and jump into the pit. Especially since we didn't even get either of their attention for some reason. Strange. Uh, well, here we are. Switch to the uh, the kniff. Okay. 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 Yeah, let's get killed by rats now, too. I hate rats. See that with the lock on? Fine when it works, but <laughs> the moment my lock on's like, yeah, let's just switch between the two fucking targets because you're using your right thumbstick. Like, thank you. That's not what I'm using my right thumbstick for, mate. Oh, look, there's more of them. Kill that one. Look at this. Yeah. Is this worth it? No, but... I'm not taking chances. Come here! What is down that way? I'm gonna go here first. Jesus, that looked like a spider. Oh. Really? I mean, I shouldn't be surprised that you're down here. You guys are fucking everywhere. There's a lot of them. I don't know if it's worth my time to kill them. Um, tell you what. I feel like something's coming up behind me, but we'll, we'll, we'll deal with that if we have to. Uh, let's put... Excuse me. Oh yeah, first off. Fucking Black Knife Taiki. Hell yeah. Oh no, we have it already at 10. Oh! Got her maxima. Awesome. Look at that. I'm, uh, we're gonna put Latena away for once. All right, Latena. We'll, we'll, we'll be back to you. Don't worry. Sure. I'm just running, running past them. Okay, we're going up here. There's still more? Because there's still that side tunnel, but I'm, oh boy. This is, this is not a short ladder. Okay, where are we now? Oh, God. Yeah, it's gonna be like this, huh? Well, they don't like fire. And I don't like them. <laughs> so... Ah! <laughs> Why? I didn't see it. <laughs> I knew it was coming, but I didn't see it. <laughs> I'm, I was just having the thought of like, I wonder if there's any buried ones. And then the game was like, yes, as a matter of fact, there is. <laughs> Why you gotta be this way? <laughs> I hate you so much. I should be using the cane, because it does fire damage. Alright, quick, equip the cane, but I can't- Ah, oh, we're dead. No, we're not. How did we survive that? I am- Oh, dear lord. Die. 
Thank you. Heal now. All right, we're out of here. Oh my god. All right, we're poisoned. That's fine. I'm climbing the ladder. <laughs> uh, uh. I really thought we would be dead there, but somehow I lived. <laughs> Okay, watch the ground. Where there's one, there's more. I, I legit didn't see it, though. But... What is that? Oh, that's... Oh! Hello. Hey, you sound sane. Use the sewer jail. Let me out of here. Come, must eat more. Defile more. Everything that matters to you for generations to come. I am the Dung Eater, a scourge upon the living. Can't attack in here. Uh. Oh, maybe we can attack. We can. God, what do I do? Do I let him go? Do I let him out? I can't target him, but I bet I can attack him. I just... No. Roderica's afraid of him. I'm worried about what he might do to her. The Blackguard's afraid of him. I don't want... I don't want the Blackguard to die. And I feel like if we let him out, Dung Eater's gonna fucking find him and murder him. And I don't want that. Now, no guarantee that this actually kills him, mind you. Holy shit, that sword. Whoa. Yeah, we, uh... Maybe we're actually supposed to kill him. This, this might not even be, uh... What did he just do? Yeah, we, we may we may be playing into his plan here. I feel like we might be. Okay. Juice up. That does a shitload of damage. Okay, what are you doing? I don't wanna know. Ooh. Okay. Wow, he can He might fuck me up. Let me tell you, and I don't- I do not want to run back here. Nope. Yes! Please. No, we got his armor. I think we actually killed him. Uh, I'm sure there was a storyline that I'm skipping with that. But... You know, I'm also role-playing this a little. And given that I kind of know what he does, I do not wish that on anyone. So we're not letting him out. We're putting him down. Like the rabid beast he is. Alright. Uh, where's this fucking weapon? Sword of Milos. Looked really cool. Here it is. Sinister greatsword fashioned from a giant's backbone. Meets out wounds like a lopsided saw blade and restores some FP upon defeating an enemy. Milos was undersized for a giant and was viewed as sullied and terribly grotesque. Unique skill, Shriek of Milos. Let's out a horrified cursed scream that reduces all damage negation and status resistances for nearby foes. That's cool. While active, strong attacks will, char will change into a combo attack. Okay. That is pretty cool. Alright, we got the Omen set. Interesting that it's called the Omen set. No, oh, the Omen armor. Very weird. Very heavy. Dear lord, that's heavy. Malformed armor resembling an omen with its horns cut off. Worn by the Dung Eater, the heavy sun-shaped medallion represents both the guidance he once saw and the ring to which... And the ring to which it will one day lead. Oh, yeah, the Elden Ring, of course. Duh. Yeah, he's after the Elden Ring, too. 
Malformed helm, yeah, okay, resembling an omen. Worn by the Dung Eater, its form is a vision of the landscape of his mind, and of his appearance as he wished to see it. The heart of an omen without the body to match. Could there be any crueler existence? What does it matter, then, if the curse claims all? Yeah, he's trying to spread his curse, right? The seedbed curses. She basically rips out of people's asses, more or less. Pretty disgusting. Yeah, alright. Uh, my apologies if any of you guys wanted me to actually pursue that storyline, but, uh... You know... My character has re-established a measure of her morality, personality. So, now, again, I'm not sure if we actually, like, really, really killed him, but we'll see. He might not... Uh, I think what we saw in Roundtable Hold was a projection. In fact, I'm almost certain it was a projection. Which means that this was the real one. Which means we did actually kill him. Oh. Slugs! Wonderful. I love slugs. Are you guys friendly slugs? No, you're not. No one, none of you guys are ever friendly. Die. Okay, I wanted to, that to go further up, but... Okay, I guess this is how it is. You, you get... Oh, Jesus. It's like a slug pit. Oh, he fell through the, through the level. Um, what do we got down there? I don't want to know. We're going to jump over this. Go this way. Jesus Christ, this place is horrible. Ugh. Ugh. Why? Why are you like this? Wish this did, like... Okay, you know what? Fine. We can do it like this. That is effective. Ugh. So I will say, I feel like they're passive. So many pits to fall down. I want to see this through to its end. Things are dying. Seemingly. Where are we now? Where are we going? This is a maze. Okay. Well, they're not all passive. Some of them are a little bit, uh... Pretty spry for a slug. Most slugs I've seen don't jump like that. I don't know about you guys. Any of you guys from Australia? Do the slugs jump in Australia? Bet they do. Oh, for fuck's sake. Another one of these, uh... Really, like, grotesque ones. Uh, yep, here he comes. Oh, he fell down? Alright, well, let's give him... Let's give him this business. Okay, he didn't like that. I didn't like that, though. Alright, if you're gonna come in here, I'm gonna hit you with this. Because you can't dodge very easily. Okay. Now, I don't know how far I can go before... Uh-oh. Before we find a pit behind us. Whoa! Whoa! Ah, oh, man. That is a long... That is a long run. To my runes. It is a very long run to my runes. Jesus, look at all the horns covering them. Yeah, the budding horns, huh? Vestige of the Primordial Crucible. Alright, what's our time at? 1 minute 14, yeah. Alright, I'm gonna cut the episode here, guys, unfortunately. We're gonna... We're gonna get our runes back in the next episode. And, uh, continue exploring the sewers. Yeah, this was a brutal episode. Fought some, uh, pretty rough enemies. Some that are justifiably rough, some that I'm just terrible against. Uh, that probably aren't even that bad. Um, yeah. Leave it a like if you've enjoyed it. And, uh, obviously, uh, comment any theories or... I mean, don't comment theories that you already know because you've beaten the game, but... If there's theories based on knowledge that I have come by that you have, uh, go for it. I enjoy reading them once again.
All right, everybody. Hope you're all doing well. Ash Heritor out.